everyone from Venice Protocol channel. In this video, we will tell you how to connect with Venice Protocol via Trust Wallet, which you will download to your mobile phone to supply our existing in Venice application to show it as collateral and to borrow money. Let's get started right away. We open the Trust Wallet application for my device. The most important thing we'll pay attention to here is the amount you'll pay for the products we use within the Venus protocol as BNB. That's why we make sure that we have BNB in our wallet, even in very low amounts. From here, we will find the Venus protocol application from the browser section. It already appears at the top in the DeFi section. We are connected to this application. After connecting to the application, the dashboard immediately welcomes us, but the values on our dashboard are currently zero because we haven't connected our wallet yet. We choose which wallet we want to connect from the connect wallet section. What is protocol has a feature of supporting many wallets here. In seconds, our wallet will be connected to the app. Our wallet is connected. Again, our instrument panel is in front of our eyes, but all of our values are zero. On this dashboard, our daily earnings, the amount we supply, and the amount we borrow are clear. Just below, our safe limit appears with a red tick. I will continue to explain this a little later. We will select amount will supply from the market section. Of course, we need to choose the value first. It also gives staking revenues with supply. It also has a feature of staking. The values these stake revenues differ. These APYs appear right next to the values on the left. Today, we'll do all transactions with BUSD. We choose BUSD for the transactions we'll do with BUSD. After selecting BUSD, the application directs us to activate it. Here, we will make a double profit. The values of our two-way gains are also clear. With the enable option, we will enable the amount we'll supply. We pay a very, very low transaction fee for this. And before supplying, of course, we enable it first. Now we have enabled it. It asks us how much we'll supply from here on. We'll trade 50 BUSD today. Here we confirm the transaction. It demands a very low transaction fee of 45 cents from us. After we approve this transaction fee, we'll supply our assets to Venus protocol and we'll start earning stake income immediately. This is very important. Even though we don't borrow money, our internally supplied asset benefits from both stakes and distributed bonus rewards, we are providing a two-way income. There are many entities here for this. Minus protocol supports many entities. For these assets, it supports, it is sufficient just to perform the transaction. Here on the dashboard, the amount we have supplied is immediately determined. We see that we supply 50 BUSD. We immediately to move on to have the borrow from the market tab. Before making borrow, we first need to show the amount we supplied collaterally. We choose the asset that we show as collateral and whatever asset we are going to receive in return. We come over that asset. We have shown BUSD as collateral and we have an 80% limit. Wall is worry, of course. Since we show BUSD as collateral, we can borrow 80%. One of the biggest features that distinguishes us from traditional products is that we borrow many with negative interest rates. Today, we will borrow 20 BUSD internally. After writing 20 BUSD, part of the ruler is full. We confirm the transaction from the borrow section. We pay a transaction fee of 69 cents. And after paying the transaction fee, we click on the borrow section and instantly we strengthen our hand without selling any of our cryptos or selling any of our values. The amount we borrowed immediately on the dashboard, it fell into our wallet. And just below there is a ruler where the tick red is our safe limit. It shows the 80% limit. When it reaches the 100%, liquidation begins. The user-friendly interface displays all the values moment by moment to protect the user. 
As seen in the video, the borrowing process is successful now. And when we look at the dashboard, we can see our limits and also we can see the ruler showing our safe limit with the red tick. Of course, it is very important to pay attention to this and it is also very important to follow it from the dashboard. One of the best advantage is when this protocol does not offer any time to repay here. The user can repay their debt the same day or they can pay after months or years. There is also no limit here. I will show you how we make a repay right after we decided to pay back. By scrolling down the app, we choose the value we borrowed before from the borrow section right there. We click on the repay tab at the top of the page and write down how much of the debt we will reimburse. We can refund as much as we want. We have the opportunity to pay part of it and we can pay the rest of it whenever we want. Our risk will decrease as much as the amount we pay back. Right now, I decided to pay the entire debt today. Right after clicking the refund section at the top of our page, it will again ask us for a low transaction fee, just like the transaction we did before. And seconds after paying the transaction fee, I have completed the debt payment process. Also, after paying the debt from that section, the amount I supply still going to continue to earn stake income. As you can see, I have paid my debt now. And right now, my risk scale is zero. As well as not seeing any risk, the amount I supply also still exists. Depending on my request in the process, I will either buy a new product or I will continue to make a stake by supplying it. Thank you very much for watching us and see you in the next videos. Bye.